No, 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 no. Oh, shit. <laughs> he came up through the bottom. Quetzal. Hey guys, Gunshy Mori here with another video, and today we are going to be going and taming a Titan. But first things first, I got a little work here to do. So first off, we gotta wait for this guy to fully grow up. Um, he's doing it. He's doing it. So what I did last night, I went out and I got the Quetzals I needed. I got some really good ones here. I'll show you. As you can see here, they are pretty decent on stats. And if I quickly show you here, yeah. I was able to get 62 on there. Yeah. That worked out really good for me. So, anyways. So he's got to grow up. Um, I'm currently breeding up these guys right here. I just got done taming those. And, uh, yeah. So basically what I'm doing now is some, like, simple creatures like anglerfish and quetzals. Like, I mean, we already did a quetzal taming video. No need to do another one where we go and tame up more. So I just did those ones. Anglerfish, I said, eh, okay, I need them. And I didn't feel like recording last night, so anyways. But now what we are working on is this. We are trying to get this ascendant. Quetzal platform saddle. I've had this blueprint here for about two days now, and I've been thinking about throwing it away because it's a little pricey. I mean, I don't know. Like, I'd have to look for other ones, but until then, this is what we're going to be working for. That's why I'm breeding up the angular fish so I can get some silica pearls. I need to get an Anki for the metal and the cementing paste. I don't know what I'm going to do for that, so. Um, I'm gonna try and get this all done here in the first hour. I have today and tomorrow off from work, so Yeah, hopefully I can get this done. I should be a video ahead right now So there won't be a video here the next day. So yeah, I should be able to figure this out Should be able to get this done and not go over 40 minutes Turns out I actually have two Quetzal saddles where to go. I swear. I just saw one uh, There it is there it is here it is Yes, I got, an, I got a Mastercraft one, so this is a lot cheaper. We're going to still have to go get a lot of silica pearls and cementing paste, but it's not as bad as uh, the Ascendant one. I mean, okay, let's look. Compared to... I mean, the armor is almost exactly the same, but, I mean, look at the price difference. It's almost cut in half. So... I'm probably going to get rid of this blueprint, and, uh, yeah, we're going to go from here. I'm just going to get the first angler egg that pops out of these two, so we should be good. Okay, so right now, I'm just going to get as much metal as I can without an Anki. It's not going to be effective at all. I'm going to get, like, shit metal. So, I got to figure something out here, eventually. So that way I can just get the metal I need but yeah until then I gotta get it by hand I found an albino t-rex only level 15 Ugh. no good t-rexes yet but seems that we are close to where what we're gonna be taming is here he should just be down here flap them wings if I'm correct he should be there he is. This is the Titan we're taming. Again, this is from that mod that I had installed. Or added the other day. The Titans Reborn. I did a mod review of it. They added a Ghost and Skeletal variant of this. The Titan as well for the Halloween event. That should spawn in. They only have like a 15% chance to spawn in instead of the regular Titan. But yeah, we got a good decent Titan here. So what we're going to do is we're going to basically build up that Quetzal base. And we're going to line up the shot. Just come in and line it up, pop off, and fire. I don't know if I can trap a Titan anyway, but I should be able to figure it out. Hopefully it's not too hard. Okay, here goes the metal. 
should not take too long here, especially with the Indie Forge. But yeah, now we got that going. Now, what do I need? What do I need? What do I need? Uh, I know I need hide. I need fiber. I need cementing paste. I just saw a dam down the way of it as well, so. But silica pearls are going to probably be the last thing we get, but I know I can get that fi fiber and hide real quick. Are you kidding? I got an infestation problem. I don't think I showed you guys this one yet. I got the Andrew Sarkis' bread up and I made, was it, made this one. Um, feel free to name it, guys. Uh, actually, do name it for me, please. Right, I gotta clean out this infestation. I gotta lead them away. I gotta lead them away into the forest. get back to you guys once I get rid of these guys. Alright, I just got all the hide here on Andy. Went and uh, slaughtered some, uh, you know, creatures. We also got some food here. I should probably throw in the feeding trough. So, yeah. Make sure you keep your dinosaurs fed. Or they die. I'm short, like, 300 hide. And, you, luckily, this one had it on her. Nice. Yes, definitely name her, guys. Um... I might also be swapping to her because she's a lot better than Andy. I ain't gonna lie. Andy's a little derpy now. And thanks to the new monkeys, look at what we do. That's just fiber. It's all the fiber you'll ever need. Yeah, I definitely got enough fiber. Way too much fiber. Okay, and I got one of the eggs here. I'm gonna hatch it up. I really don't even care what you come out as. Did I do that shit where I insta-killed it? Yep, that's on me. I insta-killed it. Shit. You actually have to be in the water. Okay, I should have an egg that should be ready to hatch by now. Yep. Also, you can't throw them in here. I already tried. Oh. Boom. Here's the problem. I actually have to get a secure pen for baby dinos. Because piranhas spawn in here. And piranhas... Piranhas will eat the baby dinosaurs. So, yeah. I could then raise it in the jacuzzi tub. Just remove the benches. Maybe I could. Maybe I could raise you in the jacuzzi tub. Nope. <laughs> no, because every. Yeah. I can't land the cryopod in here. Also, I got bored the other day and just built this while I was on. Had some extra life, threw them in here. So, yeah. Got some dope. Okay, so raising up this angler is taking a bit. Um, the, the Quetzal's almost done. So, let me quickly look here. You're only, yeah, you're only about 42%. So, it's going to take a hot second. Um, let's go see. Ow, oh, damn it. Let's go see what angler fish saddle we got. I feel like I'm not using your actual name. Do they not have a saddle? I misspelled it. No, 
god, there's no way. You guys have to have a saddle. Okay, I guess they don't need saddles. Huh. Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay. I just realized this. Our uh, anglerfish here has a muta is a is a stamina mutation because the highest we got there is 34, and this boy has one mutation, or she has one mutation, and it's into her stamina. But otherwise, she would have been good. But she does have a mutation, so I can't use her. So sadly. But well, I can use her. She's gonna be used here to get silica for it, but I can't use her for uh continuing the breeding process afterwards. So good thing I'm keeping up with the eggs. I'm just gonna keep them going here. The quetzal's fully grown. Um let me see. We're missing cementing paste, I know that. Uh what else do we need? Metal, 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 metal. Is the rest of that done? That is done. Out of here. Like this. And here you go. Boom. Alright, now we just need silica pearls and cementing paste. That shouldn't be too hard. Here should be the last one that we need for cementing paste. Are you kidding me? Only 49 on this one. All the other ones had like 200 and some shit. Ooh, there's another one. Fuck. There's a crap. They're fast in the water, but they're slow on land. I don't know what I need to do. What do I do? Let the, let the be- oh, that's, that, that's a lot of beavers. That's a lot of beavers since we abandoned this place. Uh, I've been trying to keep the beavers alive here. So, again, this is just for me to be able to- what the fuck, why? Can't worry about that, can't worry about that, can't worry about that. Just get the... See? 300. Thank you. I need to destroy the nest. It's not enough just to do that. If you don't break the nest, um, it won't respawn. So, they keep on doing that, though. They've been letting... They've been letting that deck know that they, uh, they don't like it, but... I've been trying to keep Hidden Lake as now a CP farm, but yeah. I've basically grabbed all the other cementing paste across the map. So now I'm just going to head up here into the Arctic for the pearls. Okay, now in here, we should be able to find some good dinos. I don't know if I, if I just paused and repaused or not. Um, I'll check it here later. Here's you. I need you in a cryopod so you don't die. Okay, you're not going to be like the lift of on. I can actually still drown on you. Okay. But, if I recall, I should be able to... Yep. Silica pearls for days. Just as long as you can get them, you can get them. These are the ones I'm more sketchy about.
La -dee -da 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 -da. I'm gonna get enough silica pearls here, then we get back to you guys. Okay, I should be good on silica pearls now. Uh, do -do 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 there you are. Five thousand. So I got enough here for the saddle and some extra to spare for any other uh, things that we need to craft. You never know. I might need more electronics here. I found another beaver nest. I'm gonna do it just to fuck with them some more. These last two bases I built have been right on top of like good beaver dam locations, like Lost Lake and now this place. I mean, look, there's beavers down here. I could even probably transplant some down in here by this river and just get a lot of cementing paste from it. I mean, I have not have to crafted much cementing paste. I've been just stealing it from beavers. It's just so much of it. Alrighty, here we go. Cementing paste, the silica pearls, and lastly, the crafting skill potion. So now that should have set, yep, all our crafting points in there. Why can't I? Why can't I craft you? What? Okay. Yeah. What? Oh, do I have to? Oh, I have to have them installed to craft them. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. Okay. Did you get any other stats? No. You didn't. Okay, um, I don't know what's happening here. It won't let me take it. I'll give you all this stuff. Here, is this what you want? Is that what you want from me? Why can't I take the stone, but I can't take the mat? Okay. Alright, this potion still has 30 seconds on it. So once this runs out, I'm going to go saddle up the Quetzal there. Oh my god, I just spaced off for a minute there. I got all my health and stuff back and now I'm dying. There you go. Here's your main voyage. Look at that. He's a nice, he's got some nice colors on him. I got red, mostly. Mostly. But yeah. Um, anyways, let's get a cannon on, the, on this platform. And I'm going to get a box here. One that can survive. Titanosaur. We're gonna get a bed on the back of you as well. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna set this up real quick. I just realized I was filming the whole time. Damn it. I thought I paused. Um, okay, uh, anyways, here we go. I got my cannon, box, and all that. 
So I originally had all the stuff to craft this platform, but I crafted the cannon first. And it took up so much stuff. Okay. This is going to be a little difficult. There we go. Why do I think this would be a good idea? There you go. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll store all our ammo in this. And again, this is all going to be scrap. This is going to be Quetzal Base 1. It's going to be a mobile base for us on the back of a Quetzal. That's the plans for this, dude. So, let's get... We'll, we'll figure out what we need to do with you once we get you in the air. I think what we're going to hit you with for now is some movement speed. But for now, but now, now, now. I need to get these beds down. I also need to go put this, uh... That back. Okay. That's two beds we can get around. Rear the cannon. So, this should do, for now, for taming up a titan. We got one cannon, we got an ammo box. Made sure it wasn't wooden so it wouldn't get broken easily. These beds are gonna get fucking trashed. I know it. So, yeah. If we take a hit, we're go that's not gonna be good. I mean it. It's not gonna be good if we take a hit. Now, time to carry 45 cannonballs up two flights of steps. And onto the back of a Quetzal. Ah. Your, your weight is still good. Okay, I need to heal up here a bit. And then we're going to head out for the Titan. And we are ready! Yeah. Hey, also, fun fact guys, it's day 97. Three more to go until day 100. So yeah, that's awesome. But anyways, I'm gonna go and uh, ooh, I almost forgot. Let's get this thing. You're loaded. You're loaded. Um, we're gonna get five cannonballs on me. You know what? Let's make it that I have 10 on me. There you go. I got 10 cannonballs on me. I got more in the box. Heck yeah. Okay. We should be good now. I'm gonna go line up a shot here. We're gonna get started. Okay, we're here. We're here. Let's land. We should be able to set up our cannon. Find a relatively flat spot to land. Okay. Um, aim down. Aim down. Aim down. All right. That should be what we want. And okay. No, we don't want any of that. Okay. Go line up our first shot here. Goody, that's a goody. Time to move, time to move. Okay. We got a lot of torpor to do here. Okay, cannon's loaded. Time to line up another shot. He's so good on Torpor there. Do I gotta line up? I wonder, can I get you lined up in a way where I can just... Shit. He's still trying to get at me? I think he is. But I'm pretty sure if I angle this right, I can get him caught on this cliff. Unfortunately, he's caught on this. 
Look, I only know one thing to do with Karnas, and that's drop it. Okay, um... I think... I can't wait to see more team involved, because it doesn't take that much. Boom, we got a hit. Need you to come this way, big buddy. He should come this way. If he loops around that way, we're fucked. That did no torpor. None. Um, need to line up a shot on your head with the cannon. Space makes you land. Space makes you land. Don't do that. Okay, you're turning. Don't fire. We need to get him walking in a straight line again before we fire. Here we go. That's a hit. That's a hit. That's a hit. Up, 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 up. Okay, okay. Reload, reload, reload. Okay, how much store for we do? Nice. Another hit, another hit. Ah, that's a complete fucking win. I need to quit hitting that. I think he's pissed at me. Ooh, ooh, I'm right. That was so fucking pointless because now I have to. One more. Now I had to recenter it. Oh shit. Yeah, I should just keep it centered. Just keep it centered. Damn it, why'd you have to turn? I don't know if I got that one on camera. I just did that one like almost point blank into its skull. Look, I damaged the cannon. Shit. I almost broke the fucking cannon. Oh, I can't do that again. That was a bad hit. That did so much damage to me. Ah, I don't think I have enough cannonballs. Damn it, there we go. I hit it, I hit it. I was trying to hop in and I hit everything except the bed. Okay. Okay, come on, spin your head around. Oh, okay, okay. You're caught on something there. Let's just see if I can line your head up. That's not good. What happened there? Did I whiff that shot? I completely whiffed that damn shot. Okay, okay, one more, one more. One more, then we might have to change up our plan here. There's got to be a way to trap these guys. Come on, come on, come on. Should I do that time? None. Okay. Let's get your tour for 26. Oh, this might take a while. It, it's nice to see that he doesn't lose any tour for though. Another one bites the dust. That's a straight into his chest. Yep. No tour for. Normally, you should just have two people doing this, and one person just on that turret shooting the cannon constantly, you know? But I don't have two people for this. You know? I don't got two people. This is a solo series. I don't know why I'm solo taming this Titan. These shots are whips. And fire. There we go. That's one. And again, we might. If we hurry, we might, we might be able to hit another one. 
we go. Where are you running? Where are you running? Where are you running? Where are you running? Running into the Arctic. No, like he's quite literally running into the Arctic. Shit. If he gets caught on something, I could probably just. Awesome. There we go. Running. Any more dam more damage to the fucking cannon. Shit. No 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 no. Oh shit. <laughs> he came up through the bottom. Quetzal. <laughs> that was. He came up through the bottom. Was lining up a shot and that scared me and we are here about the halfway point and I just broke the cannon so yeah uh, I think I have enough back at the base to craft it up but I don't know if this guy's gonna lose torpor or not so I guess we'll figure that out so uh, the Titan has managed to work its way towards the Redwoods I mean he's doing he ain't doing too hot He's gonna pass out here, here hopefully, in a couple dozen more cannonballs. I'm starting to run low, so hopefully it doesn't take too much more. We are so close. So close. He's at 2,000. Perfect timing for fog to roll in so I can't see the Titan. There you are. Uh, I'm trying to line up a shot here so I can show you guys what I've been doing. I mean, he's not there, there, but he's there. I've only landed one shot since I last showed you guys it. Basically, wait for him to go like that. Hit E, turn around, and that one is really bad. Whoa, what the hell? What was that? What was that? Seriously, what made that noise? Oh, I'm just nailing into him here. Oh, he's moving. Ooh, I just landed three shots in a row. Okay, he's got like one more tops. I'm gonna wait for him to run to the other side here. Fuck, he's gonna be in the water. I wanna risk it in the water. I'm gonna risk it. I think he might be too big to die in the water. He's too big. Is that how he's unconscious? It is. Okay, we have him out. Let's uh Huh. Okay. I don't know how I'm gonna. I think I know how I'm gonna do this now. Okay, we're on him. We're on him. We can access. Um. Supposedly, it's supposed to take food. Uh, extraordinary kibble. Is that the one I have up in my chest? There ya. Here we go. Okay, so this thing should be... Doesn't seem to be losing any food. Okay. Um... Huh. I don't know. Okay, guys, I don't know how well you can see me here, but... <clears throat> I had a little bug there where I accidentally... Well, it wasn't a bug, it was on my end. I had the hunger for Ray Dinos turned all the way down. So it wasn't starving. I have now changed it. So he's starving up. But that's going to take a lot longer here. And I still don't have a saddle yet. 
So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to end it here. I'm going to tame him up, take him back to the base because I can cryopod him now. And yeah, that should be it. But I'm going to call it here, end the recording. So anyways, if you guys like what you see, uh, please leave a like and subscribe. And uh, do leave a comment for that Andrew Sarkis. And I have also changed our uh, subscriber goal. So if you guys hit 400 subscribers, I will go to Lost Island. Alright, I'll go to Lost Island at 400 subscribers. I'll tame up the three things there, okay? And for 600, I know, 200 jump there. We'll do the Broodmother. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm just doing this because I'm going to prep for the Dodo Rex here. Anyways, so yeah, that's the plan. So anyways, do leave a like and subscribe. Remember to ring that bell. And anyways, this has been Gunshot Mori signing off. Peace. Peace.